Don't let children watch this. Just a little. I respect you, Trevor. Strangely, I do. I believe how you're useful. You're terrifying. You're useful. Like, damn. Good enough to me. I'm sorry. 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 I'm sorry
masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. Oh. Refrigerator's broken because uh, Trevor jammed a body in there. Probably the old manager. I would like, love to switch to Trevor, thank you. There's a couple of armored cars on a dry run to the depository. Intel suggests they'll be going down Innocence Boulevard in East LS at approximately 1530. Trevor and I need to map their route for a possible hijack point. So, we're going to his airfield in Blaine County and coming back in his chopper to intercept. Michael, Franklin, all you gotta do is take the temperature at the bank, see if there's anything that stands out. Let's drive all the way out to the airfield. Here we go. I've got another job I want your help with after this. Yeah, right. Whatever. No! Seriously, man. A big job. Payment up front. What is it? Yeah! I don't know why I didn't think of it before. I want to bring you in on the ground floor this time. That's not a joke about disabled access. I didn't think it was, but now I do. I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna be on board. He's obligated. What is it? Ain't it obvious? Bustin' Brad out of the clink. Okay, I'm gonna stop you there, T. Some things are just better left alone. Brad's not a thing. He's part of the crew. Well, a crew's more than a sum of its parts, and he was a pretty shit part. He is a pretty shit part, and that's only because he's in jail. No, he was, is shit because he's lazy, forgetful, mean, and stupid, with respect. He's changed, all right? He writes now, emails, he's educated himself inside, and... All right, we're here. Only one security guard. Looks like a normal consumer bank up here. We're going down to the back entrance to see where the gold comes out. Why don't you talk to Michael about it? I will. But I gotta talk to you too. You're planning this. Talk are to you, Michael and come back coming? to me. Oh, You're just gonna sit in the truck. Shit. Okay. I was gonna pay you, man. When there ain't an obvious profit in something, you're a hard guy to motivate. See you later. Wait. Lester, if you're fuck. He was abandoned because he was just fucking sitting there in the truck and not moving. Are you kidding me? I want to bring you in on the ground floor this time. Okay, That's hit shit here, shitstorm. Let me fucking That's not bring you about to where you can get just climb out place. of the truck right now into. I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna okay. be on board. He's obligated. Oh, now you're a fucking magician. Get in. You're the one who keeps talking about the schedule. Rest. Thank you. Come on. Mike's observations fit with your scheme. So far, yeah. The security's internal rather than external. It's quiet enough. Be careful not to get too close to the prison. Shut your fucking face. I know. This is my airfield. I fly over here all the time. Yeah. Trevor, how you doing? Well. I like clockwork, Mikey. I like clockwork. Come in, Michael. We have a visual on the convoy. Keep with them, T. Do whatever Les needs you to do. We need to stay with them and find a place to ambush. What kind of ambush spot are we looking for? I tend to wait in the jaw and catch them with their drawers down, but I guess that won't work here. No, it uh, won't. We're looking for somewhere with cover for us and no escape routes for them. Ah, the same principle as a men's room. Yeah, uh, I guess. <laughs>
What you thinking? I'm thinking I don't like being in close proximity to you for extended periods of time. In the same for short periods of time. Oh, there's ways to make minutes go by. Yeah. And you wouldn't like it even more than what you don't like now. Taco Bob. I want some tacos. I've lost sight of them. Think they might be in the tunnel. Don't worry, it's a straight road. They'll come out the other side. I'll go around. Meet them at the other end. I was hoping they'd come through here. This tunnel would work for a switch. They go in, you come out. Okay, they'll be back out in the open now. It'll have to be a quick turnaround, but you can hijack the trucks in there. I'm picking up the cars. Right on time. Hey, it, uh, it looks like we're gonna need some IDs to get in the building this way. I'm assuming that's doable, Les. IDs I can handle. Onion 86 in sight. Stand by. Hey, I was expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Onion 86 in the building. Now, if I remember from planning the tool store job, they're excavating the new LS Metro tunnel around here. They take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that. Looking for a big asshole. Ah. There it is. There's your big asshole. Hover above it while I record what we need. I need to be above, shooting down into it. You need to shut the fuck up and give me a second. Just hold the chopper here. You can do that, right? That's no good. It's load bearing. A little longer. Steady now. Hold here. Alright, I think I've got enough information to work with. Cool. Um, go to airfield or switch to Michael. Let's, let's stay on Trevor. So, uh, providing either of these ways into the bank works, the armored cars are the big hole in the ground, how are we gonna get the metal out? That's the 20% of $200 million question. If the armored cars are a viable option, we'll bring out the gold in them. Simple. You won't even have to fire a shot if everything goes to plan. When does everything go to plan? If it's ever going to, this is the time. Sounds hopeful to me. You got a backup plan? We can modify this chopper to carry the weight, but we'd need another one to match. Easy enough to get. If we're using it for the job, would you consider taking your name off the side? <laughs> you think I'm taking down the Union Depository and anything other than a chopper with my name on it? Well, then you don't know me, bro. <laughs> I thought you'd say that. And we are back. You're not gonna let me do it until I land right on the fucking... I got two ideas. It's gonna take a while to get them together or work them up, but I think there's a way. It's not impossible. All right, we'll start thinking about the breakout too. Bradley Snyder, he's getting bored. Talk to Michael, okay? Goodbye. Surveying the score. Yeah, get the fuck out of there. Oops. How do I... Fuck the feds. Alright guys, well that's going to bring us to the end of another episode. If you did like the episode, make sure to mash that like button. And I will catch you next time. Peace!